Wait, don't hug too much. What are they doing? This is so fucking creepy, dude. Also, I just gotta be real for a second. Do not harass the people in this in these things. They're not actually like this. I fucking hope. I am allowed to criticize and make fun of their terrible, terrible content, just like they can criticize and make fun of my terrible, terrible content. We're all in this together, guys. Remember that. This video is called We Robbed the Apple Store. What? You did? Isn't that a f federal crime? It says 2 million views and it was uploaded f four days ago, dude. No comments, though. Why are the comments turned off? Oh. Because it's a baby video. It's for babies. YouTube babies. They disable comments whenever it's only babies watching. Look at this. Oh, crap. Who's Ferran? Oh, my God. He's robbing the Apple store. He just stole 10 iPhones. Today, we're looking at the royalty family. The greatest family vlogging channel. Not Maybe not the greatest. The richest family vlogging channel on YouTube. Okay, guys? And thank you for watching another daily upload. I appreciate you guys. Oh, my gosh. Everything is gone. Call the cops. That bastard just robbed the Apple store. And now he's cranking 90s on fork, fork knife. He's got more fucking drip than I could ever even imagine. Holy shit. So our friends, the Anasala family, who you right. guys probably know by now, no. actually built their own Apple store in their own house. Dude, that's crazy. That's amazing. It's so realistic. It looks like this. I fucking hate rich people, dude. I'm gonna be honest, I fucking hate rich people. And you guys are probably like, Obelville, Obelville, you're rich. You're rich, you're a YouTuber, you're a world savage YouTuber. I didn't make any money for two years because I got oh, yeah. demonetized and I still don't. All right, by the way, this video is brought to you by Sour Boys Sour Candy. I actually, I have my own candy company. It's a bit of a passion project. Yeah, use code OOMPA at sour.gg for 10% off, by the way. We haven't made any money, actually, technically, but it's expensive to run a business, but I, I enjoy seeing your guys' feedback and people like this who send me bags of the candy on Twitter and whatnot. I appreciate you guys. And I am also not rich and probably will never be this rich. This seems real. A lot of Apple stores, and it looks exactly like that one. Yeah, that yeah. Apple store is legit. I love how they all seem so genuine and, and charismatic, and they absolutely love their jobs. Also, he doesn't ever look in the lens of the camera like this. He's always looking just above it at himself in the viewfinder. <laughs> Fuck I hate that, dude. I have special eyes. Look. Look with your special eyes. That is one of my biggest pet peeves whenever I see YouTubers just like, Right, guys, hello, right, so let's today we're welcome back on another erection video, and I love looking at myself. You guys know Mila, she's my adopted daughter, but you guys took her away from me. She loves we're training her. her. Yep, 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 okay, she loves me more. Yeah. Alright, so you guys- I don't know the lore of the royalty family, but that seems like, that seems really weird. I know this whole thing is just a prank, bro, but like, someone help that child. Also, I know I adopted a child for a, from the dark web or whatever for a oh, yeah. day or something. It's my best friend's child. Okay, guys. It was, a, it was all very obviously a, a joke. Very obviously a joke. And it was quite funny as well. That's usually what, what joke, jokes usually are, are funny. All right, here he comes. Here's Ferran. He's going to go rob. Oh, look. Everything, everything. Yeah, get, get it. Everything, bro. Steal it, bro. Steal it. Steal everything from them. I'm going to start with the iPhone first. This is a good example to set for children. So he's literally, he's like, he's in the middle of a heist in GTA 5. Who's that blonde guy from GTA 5? I haven't played the game in so long. He calls up and he's like, The heist is passed. Heist completed. And you're probably in on this. No, I'm not. Dude, and clearly you are too. This is so real. Hey, we should leave. We're leaving. We're leaving. No, we're leaving. We're leaving. What? Here. Not, no one. The demon. Oh. That'd be funny if it just what are you about? got really. Oh. Stop, Mila. You got us. Oh, no. Go, run. Run. Run for us. They literally live in oh, yeah. GTA 5. What is going on right now? I don't understand. Also, 100% literally just clickbait and maybe not a great example to set for the millions of children that watch your content is that it's okay to steal phones from people and then just say it's a prank. You know what that means, right? Let's, let's exploit our son. What does that mean? Make an example of him and then make content out of it. <laughs> We've seen where this leads, guys. Remember Daddy of Five? Yep. I'm not comparing them to Daddy of Five, by the way, but I am a little bit because that's like this obviously is probably another clickbait joke pr slash prank thing, but <laughs> just see, it's so on the nose, man. All right, I'm gonna put 30 minutes starting now. Go, go. So they let him okay? game for 30 okay, minutes? 30 minutes. I know, your, mom I know. I, your mom and I are going to the mall. So we told him, only 30 minutes. Let's see what happens. So they set a timer for 30 minutes. He's only allowed to game for 30 minutes. They have a hidden cam. A hidden cam 
And they're gonna epically break their own son! Alright, so I told them game, game. Them all, okay? Mm -hmm. Obviously, we're gonna stay here. Yeah. We're gonna watch them on camera, mm -hmm. on our phone. Yeah. And then, we're just gonna see what happens. Yeah. Right. Okay. If he stays past the 30 minutes, we're gonna- going to fucking kill him. Hey guys, what's up? This part of the video, press the like button if you want to see more content like this, where I'm just a dick, basically. Hit the subscribe for more! Turn on notifications so you don't miss any. Look, a funny-ass meme that's so hilarious, it's crazy. Go ahead and caption this image to feed the algorithm. Okay, my friends, here's the image from the last one. Here's the best comments. I'm gonna eat them. All right, and also, here's a shout-out to the people, obviously. Thank you so much. Please enjoy. Press the video. We're gonna see how much longer he stays, yeah. and then we're just gonna confront him. Troll him. He might be a good boy, and he might only play for 30 minutes. I have a strong doubt that that's gonna happen. Fortnite, Let's Fortnite. Go pleasant Park. Let's go. Let's go. Dropping, dropping. Look at him. He's literally cranking 90s right now. Okay, he's faced with the moment of truth. The moral dilemma. The child faces. Shall I game for longer than 30 minutes? He turned it off. What did he do? What did he do? We got content. What's going on? Still playing? Yeah, why are you still playing? Um, your, your 30 minutes are off. Let me see the timer. Well, you've been playing for like an hour. You went oh, over no, not an, hour. an hour. There's no way he got that good by playing 30 minutes a day, by the way. What does that mean? Is that grounded? I hope he cries. He is a bad, bad man. I understand you got excited, you're happy, you're having fun. Yeah, consequences. But you also got to follow the rules. Yep, there's you got too many monitors, there's, buddy. There's, there's rules you you, you expect follow. to be able to use these for more than 30 minutes right? a day? You yeah. expect? Go down to the dungeon! The 8,000 square foot dungeon in the basement of our 55,000 square foot house in the hills of GTA. This one's called spying on our son and his crush. We caught them. Doing what? Also, they're eight years old. We are spying on two eight-year-olds. This is going to be so epic. That's, <laughs> that's, that's one way to put it, I guess. You know, famous words said by family vloggers and... John Wayne Gacy. Holy shit. Can I have something in money? Sure. He's keeping it away. He's funny. Baby, come. Huh? Oh my god. No, baby, don't do it. Don't do it, baby. No, 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 no. Dude, this is the most uncomfortable I've ever been watching a cot. Like, I know this is not made for me, by the way. I, I, I need to make that very clear, and I'm not insinuating anything. It's just the f optics of the situation. It's the way it looks, you know? It's the way they're portraying it. They have functioning brains. They know exactly what they're doing. I know what I'm doing in all my thumbnails and titles, and I push the limits occasionally and have in the past. Generally speaking, the more and more I learn and the more and more I care, which I haven't cared that much until quite recently, I'm going to be honest, the more strange this type of stuff seems and the more moral dilemmas i involve myself in every single day don't be scheming away his money like, yeah she just why? said that we just got mansplained we taking his money wait wait uh, no 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 Dush, relax, relax this is the dumbest thing i've ever seen in my entire life dude <laughs> what the fuck <laughs> They're fine. Oh, they're they're bargaining. They're having like a little exchange, a little uh, a little barter moment. Oh my god! What the hell? Oh Why are they fighting? Oh it's watching two little chimpanzees. God! Oh my god! Two little like chimpanzees in the zoo. Oh gosh, fight! 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 Oh. fight! Yeah! Yeah! Don't hit her. I want the one with the long hair to win. There you go. Yeah. Wait! Wait! Don't hug too much. What are they doing? This is so fucking oh, yeah. creepy, dude. Hey, when you're in there and you're fighting with the little eight-year-old girl, by the way, eight-year-old son, don't hug too much, but hug enough to where we can say don't hug, hug too much and, and we can wrap this entire video with disturbing insinuations of things that should not be allowed to be even thought about. <gasps> oh my God, dude. Right. <laughs> What is she wearing? Is she wearing a fucking onesie? We have two hunter gatherers encouraging the first the first inklings of the industrial society. We're witnessing capitalism in its truest form. Bronte fam, we're so sorry. They're whispering too much. I don't know what they're saying. Babe, did you, did you I'm, very, I'm very curious. We gotta find out. We gotta right. get closer to that. Let me go there with the camera. And what the fuck is wrong with these people? Holy shit. Obviously, this is all fake and set up. I just... Man, this is weird. It's just the whole thing is so strange. And by the way, the rest of that video is so boring, uninteresting, and repetitive. I've lost IQ points, EQ points, 
by the way, and I'm now insulin resistant. All right, guys, I'm a type one diabetic now because of this video. So if that gives you any idea of where I'm at, in terms of my headspace. Hiding from my parents at home, they <gasps> freaked out. Remember that kid that was stuck in the weather balloon? What you all see right there is an experimental aircraft that inside of which is a six-year-old boy. Or so everyone thought, and there was a bunch of news coverage about it, that he actually, he was just hiding in the attic or something, and he like came out to go get food or something like that. It happened a long time ago. That's what this reminds me of. I'm currently home alone right now, and right. when my parents come back, Right. I'm gonna hide from them. Right. He hides from them, and the parents know exactly where he is and that he's hiding from them, and they're making a video on it that got 4 million views a month ago. That's what this video is. It's 16 minutes of question marks. And might I say, you are looking drunk. Also, this Dick random, gorgeous. random part in the, in the random part in the video. Right. They probably have like a contractual obligation. She she has to have at least one gas up session per every video. <laughs> Drop dead and go. Yes. Yeah. You are a good looking woman, but drop dead gorgeous? I wouldn't say that. I'm drop dead gorgeous. All right. And I would say that. She's got to be in the house somewhere. Right. Ooh, look at somewhere in the 50,000 square foot house. Ooh. Bro. You are a stud. The collective ego of this family. Is fucking incredible. Can't talk right now. I'm burning. <laughs> they're coming, they're coming. He's burning! The door's open. The door's open. I didn't leave this door open. Baby, I didn't leave this door open. He's literally Someone baking alive on the, on the balcony or whatever that is. Oh he's cornered like an animal, literally. He's in a cage. Oh my god, oh my god. He's so bad. Someone fucking help the little child. <laughs> Give up minutes. before he dies from the heat, huh? like a brachiocephalic dog. Give up, Give up before the child dies. It's been more than ten minutes. Okay, I'll go till the time is over and I won. Great, you won. Oh what do you gosh. get? Fifty thousand dollars? I won. Are you serious, bro? I won. Bro, where were you? You went to say Gucci's house. Bro, stop. Where were you? Where? I am burning right now. Come here. Where were you? Oh Gucci's my gosh. Last you were in Gucci's cage? You guys think they lock their dog outside because it barks a lot? <laughs> and they just like have it on like a little balcony thing. <laughs> Nothing necessarily wrong with that, but that's that just seems like that's what's going on. I really don't know. I'm not making allegations that that's negative either. I mean, your dog makes a bunch of noise and you, you don't train it properly, then that's fine. But that sort of looks like what's going on. Because why would you have a dog cage in like an outside area with blankets in it unless that's where it lives. This video is called Baby Milan has an eye problem breaking heart emoji. The baby has an eye problem, guys. Or does it? Yeah. We don't know if we're overreacting or over exaggerating. Right. But she, You're concerned you should always bring it in. Because she right, showed right, me right. some photos. Yeah. Bring it in. That's a good picture. It does look like this eye is turning inward. Right. How old is he in this picture? If you focus too much, sensor to focus, you make your eye turn too much, you might see the eye turn inward. Okay? Right, so a possibility for something so basically what, what she's saying is that they the baby does not have a problem and the, they got 3.1 million views by clickbaiting that their child has an eye problem and when in reality the baby's just a fucking baby and he's got wonky eyes because that's what babies do their whole bodies are wonky they can't even run all right i've challenged so many babies to 40 yard dashes it's not even funny and also this thing try to get a baby to use this thing all right watch this you think a baby can do this shit? I didn't think so, motherfucker! I didn't think so. That isn't even my max, by the way. I've done it like six times today. I can crush an apple with my bare hands. Have you ever seen a baby do that? No. I can also do this. Have you ever seen a baby do that? Yes, this baby. All right? And it's normal. <laughs> He's really going at you. He's a very adorable baby, too. It is a cute child. He really wants to... It is a cute family. I've got to be honest. They're, the family is cute. It's like, you can see the, the, the genuineness and the reality kind of poking through when they're not hustling to get those views in every single waking moment of their lives. But I do appreciate that. I do appreciate that. But overall, this whole thing has me feeling down and low. Lower than the floor. Time to have a couple children. All right, guys. Time to have a couple children. When my views go down, I'm going to start popping out babies. And I'm going to have the, the Oompaville Royal... The Oompa Villains... The Oompaville... Oompa Family. Leave a name for my family channel down below. Watch this video. Press the like button. Hit the subscribe button. Turn on all notifications, guys. Because I upload daily. Watch this. Thank you so much. I don't... I'm very confused.